This would, hi, it's Jeffrey Langloy, Langloy's Vital Nutrition Center. This is the second video on the importance of B vitamins and the difference between the standard processed B vitamins and some of the B vitamins that you find off the shelf, even in so-called whole food. This is just one brand here. It's a food vitamin, organic, whole foods. Yet, in my world, it's not a complete B complex. And one of the reasons for that is we find that there appear to be more B vitamins found in food than they're actually um, sold in multiple vitamins. So this is a list. And you see here B1, B2, B3, B5, B6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 12. Um, eight of these are considered essential or that you must have. But there is research from 80, 90 years ago showing that when you have all of them and that there can be up to 22 different B vitamins, even tw actually 24 B vitamins, that when they are all together, they work better. And I can tell you that from using the heart sound recorder developed by Royal Lee in the 1950s, that we see greater changes in the heart sound recorder when people use a whole food B complex. Now the best source of B vitamins traditionally in the diet has been liver and organ meats, but we do not eat liver and organ meats anymore. And so a lot of us are missing some of these extra B vitamins that you do not find in off the shelf. So what you find is you find eight B vitamins. But like I said, Royal Lee talked about 24 different B vitamins. And it is my understanding that those are found in whole foods. I don't have a laboratory to test them, but I, I, and a, I don't have a laboratory to test the B vitamins, but I do have a heart sound recorder. And I do know that we see greater changes when people use the whole food B vitamins instead of the um, man-made, even the natural organic man-mades. And that would be a different video explaining the man-made whole food vitamins versus true whole food vitamins. Thank you very much.